Hey guys, Brent here. I just arrived at my friend Macca's house and I'm really excited because I'm going to photograph the most beautiful bird on earth. Well, I think it is. The rainbow lorikeet. So, here yeah, guys, let me grab my equipment and go visit my friend Macca. I'm trying to photograph these lorikeets, but I've got a challenge for myself. There's a creative constraint I've put on myself this month. And it's all because of my membership boot camp. The challenge this month is all about single focal length, meaning I can only use one focal length lens. So I've decided on using my 25 millimeter lens on this Lumix camera, which is equivalent to a 50 millimeter lens on a full frame sensor camera. And the problem is every time I sneak up to these lorikeets, they take off before I'm close enough. So I've had to come up with a creative way of photographing them. It's put my camera on a tripod and put the camera really close to the feeders and then move away and use a remote control. So there's an app that I can download onto my phone and I can control the camera remotely via Wi-Fi. So I can actually sit inside with Macca and photograph these lorikeets as soon as I get used to the camera being close to the feeder. So let me go do that now. And the lorikeets are just flying around my head over here. So hopefully they'll come back and settle soon and I can get some photos. Next thing to do is connect my phone to the camera via Wi-Fi. Let's, so let's see if it works this time. The only thing to do now is go inside, relax, and wait for the lorikeets to come back. I think they are perched in the trees surrounding us. Well, I can hear them. They're just a little spooked right now, so hopefully they'll come in soon. This is life. Enjoying a beer with a friend, photographing birds remotely. What could be better? <laughs> Cheers. Look at all the birds behind me on the speeder. I can get reasonably close. <laughs> this is so much fun. Photographing remotely. And I got the kookaburras on the perch too, which is really cool. Just having the most fun over here at Macca's house. What I had him do was roll up to the feeder there when there was like 30 birds in there and they all flew away and I photographed them remotely at 1 250th of a second and there's just this blur of color flying past the camera. Just an amazing image. Check this out. So much fun. And thanks Maka for the beer. It's really nice and cold and tasty. Scaring the budgies. <laughs> I don't like doing it, but for the sake of photography, I did it. <laughs> of things I learned from this photo shoot is these birds are very very loud these rainbow lorikeets so I've actually had to move away down the garden a little bit to to talk to you and also um, when you have a creative challenge a creative constraint like this with a fixed focal length lens you tend to become more creative because you have to think outside the box so I had to put it on remote control put my camera close to the uh, feeders and um, and then I could control it and actually get some amazing shots and I could change the shutter speed and the aperture to to get those blurred uh, motion color images which are just amazing 
But a couple of other things that happened that I didn't actually expect. I've actually visited my friend, Maka, more times than I probably would have in a whole month. I've, this is my fourth or fifth time here to try and get the shots. So there's a uh, added benefit. You're going to visit a friend. You also get to slow down and enjoy the process, enjoy the, the photo shoot, because you have to wait for the lorikeets to come back. And the beer's always cold and the beer's always good, which is great. And you can enjoy the company and you're not rushing off to go somewhere else and do the next photo shoot. Your action step, if you're watching this video, which you are, if you watch this far, thank you very much, is to set yourself a creative challenge, your own creative challenge. Maybe have a fixed focal length lens and walk around for a whole month and try and photograph things with a fixed focal length lens and see how it changes you. See what you learn by slowing down and having a creative constraint like that. That's it guys, I um, hope you enjoyed this video and all the loud lorikeets behind me. Um, please leave me comments below, I will uh, reply to all the comments and make sure you share this video if you like it with your photography friends and um, I'll catch you next time. Cheers!